What's up, what's up, people, and welcome to the Den episode two. You got your girl yeah, Ellie see. here in the building, <laughs> and we got your co host Waverly Jones in the building. Wave Jones, oh, you can see it. Wave Jones, the round table, you know what it is, round table podcast. It's goat time. She said it, so I have to. Let's go. It's goat time. All right, all right, all right. So tonight, ladies and gentlemen, we have a special guest, mm. one of my favorite R and B artists out here, and we also have another special guest on the side sitting in. Hey, girl. Yeah. So we got my girl Ray Jean Denise in the building. With it, with it. Ray, you want to introduce yourself? My name is Ray Jean Denise, like she said, and that's just who I am. Nah. So anyway, guys, Ray is a dope R and B artist. Definitely check her out on YouTube on all streaming platforms. She got some mm-hmm. dope R and B music for sure. So Ray, tell the people a little a little bit about yourself and what you got going on. Um, <clears throat> I'm a writer. Right. I don't consider myself a singer. I mostly write. Um, I do R and B. I also do pop music. I do anything that I feel. I'm not in a specific genre, um, and that's just a test of what I was raised growing up listening to. Um, and yeah, I just want to create music. Create my mind. That's what's up. So, Ray, tell the people what inspired you to want to write, as you say. Right. Um, I was 15. I wrote a song for my dad, my very first song. It was actually a gospel song, and the song was fire. And I'm like, dang, I didn't know I could do this with my pen. Shout out Big E to Eric Yo, Oliver, dope, it? dope artist, yes, definitely very talented trombone yes. player, check him out. Check him out. So yeah, I wrote a song for him, and yeah, I was 15, and then from there, I just kind of like kept going and growing and learning the craft of writing and, you know, just expanding on it over the years, so... That's pretty much it. That's how I got started, for real, for real. That's awesome. Writing. I did not know that you wrote a song for Eric. And mm-hmm. I remember when he was in his recording days, oh, yeah. when y'all was in Hannibal uh, or whatever. What was that, so, the 90s? Yeah, I think it was the 90s, Dang. I believe. Was that more? You was a baby. Hey. And it probably was like a little bit before you was born, too. But um, anyway, so what's uh, one of the first songs that you wrote for yourself? First song I wrote for myself? Well... I ain't write it. Okay, the first song I wrote or like came up with. Well, okay, let's say the first song you came up with. I was like six. Okay. And it was like, I, I don't even want to talk about that. But no, that's the go first ahead. Song. Tell your story. It's a trash song. But that's when I first realized like, oh, I got, I knew it was something at six. Mm-hmm. But 15 is when it really, really was like, well, I can do this. Okay. So I would say after 15, the first song was... What was my first song? I really don't remember. I guess it would be I Know My Car. Which is one of my favorite songs. I love that song. I'm still waiting on it to be released. You guys, y'all gonna love it. It's a cute little ballad. It is cute. It is. I love that song. I don't know if I'll ever release it, but... Why? Okay, well, that's another conversation (laughs) that we don't have at a later time. Okay, so when uh, did you start performing? Performing, uh, I would say last year is when I really started. Um, I did a sh- well, it wasn't a show, it was like an open mic thing at the Groove Lounge here in Buffalo, New York. Mm-hmm. Um, and then my first official show was at the Juneteenth Festival. Um, I did uh, like three songs there, and that was the first time I really was like in front of a big, big crowd. And then from then on till now, I've just been out here performing, showing my face, letting people know who I am, and Sure. No, just booked and busy. Yeah, booked and busy. Trying. Okay. Trying. So before we go any further, guys, we have this little segment on the show that we call the fit check. So we gonna get into the outfits of what everybody got on to. No, I'm looking like Michael Jackson from oh. the Bad Eye. <laughs> <laughs> you see the curl? You see the curl? You see how the curl is hanging? It's sitting nice. I'm just saying, I'm feeling like Michael Jackson from the Bad Album right now. If you feel me, you know what I'm saying? I'm feeling right. like. 
<laughs> nah, but yeah, definitely fit check. Yeah, fit check. Trying to get these mics and then just the vibe. All right, right so I guess bit. I'll start. You gonna start this? Yeah, I got my little, my little black and yellow on. Hey, yo, yeah. if we're too loud, if we're too loud, please let us know. We just trying to make sure everybody get the, uh, you know, the, the volume check, everything. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. So I got on my black and yellow today, you know black what I'm saying? Yellow, I'm an 80s yeah. baby, grew up Rocking in the 90s. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I got my, TV, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't own any of the, the branding rights to this. <laughs> <laughs> you got the good, the you good know, black jeans. I got jeans, my good fashion wish. Nova jeans, busting out the seams. Y'all can see that. Then I got on the back Show in the back pocket. Then I got on my black and yellow. You know, the hornets. You know what I'm saying? You know, the hornets. You know, yellow toes in here one time for you. You know, light work, light work. You know, we'll see. Looking good. We can go around the board. We can go around the room. Ladies first. All right, guys. We doing fit check. Fit check. Fit check. She got the arm out. Little arm, arm out, sexy well, and wearing. We fashion Nova. Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova fits. With a little we need a sponsor because okay. we always hollering out Fashion Nova. Okay. I love Fashion Nova. When I get famous, I hope to like partner with them. Are you famous? 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 Are you you are the Shein from, okay. the, from the top to okay. the bottom to okay. the shoes to the kick. Hey. Hey. We the in the Shein. The Shein. Don't talk to strangers. Niggas don't do that. They weird. It's an alien on her shirt. What was it? That's funny. It's an alien. <laughs> All right, guys. Now we wait no way, you know. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm, I apologize. All right, we right, we're gonna do my fit check. All mm-hmm. right. Well, while well, I'm sitting down, I'm gonna give it to you like this. So <laughs> I got um the round table podcast. You know what I mean? The round table fit. You know what I mean? Go check in with me. I can get you that. You know what I mean? It's all exclusive. Look, look. And it's a new era, but I don't know which side it's on. New era. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So real shit. You know what I mean? And my shit is detailed. Got the WJ in the back. Waverly Lee Jones. You know what I'm saying? Not yet. Um, hair by my cousin. You know what I'm saying? I'm a rock star shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? But, um, uh, I don't know. This is, uh, oh shit, I'm about to fall. <laughs> I'm hung up in the goddamn shit. <laughs> Everybody have been falling tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's a fine it's team. Yeah, right, y'all. Yeah. We right. So I got, uh, like, <laughs> you know, little bullshit bomber uh, from Tamu. I don't know what the fuck that. Tamu. Yeah, yeah, from Tamu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, shirt making waves. You know what I mean? That's what we do. Sponsored by my brother. I don't know. This is a gift. Thank you, my brother Mac in the back. Motherfucking podcast phantom. Um, these some gifts a lot. Uh, I don't know. Jeans, I guess. Yeah, I got those from there. And then, um, I'll keep them all. I ain't lifting my legs up. And then I just got some good Jordan ones too, you know what I mean? Yeah, some yeah, good, yeah, that's the one some black good some good pad and shit. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But yeah, that's me. Oh, oh, one, one last thing. Um, the the mail carrier bag. You know what I'm saying? It's a purse. No, it's not. <laughs> a man purse. It's called a mail carrier's bag. It's a merchant's bag. Okay. This is what they used to wear back in the Crooks and Castle days when a nigga was delivering a note. He brought it in the satchel like this, and that's what this is. Okay. It, it's the blamey pack. It's it's the blamey. Oh, it's the blamey pack. It's the uh, get back pack, and it's also the cash stack. So you know what I mean? It's the, yeah, don't yeah. hate on the and, and I don't give a fuck because my my aunt, which is like my mama, bought it for me for my birthday. So fuck you. Man. <laughs> Don't hate on the man bag. <laughs> I said I never would wear one. I said I would never wear one. I laughed at my brother for so long, and then my aunt bought me one. I said I have to wear it. Of course. My aunt bought it for me. She like my mom. So yeah. It's a fine bag. I ain't gonna lie. It's leather. It's, nice. it's not leather, but it's leather. It's leather. It's leather. It's nice. <laughs>
Yeah, the blammy pack. You gotta keep the blammy pack. The blammy pack. Yeah, it's on the shoulder. You don't you don't wear it on the one arm. Elevate the one shoulder. You gotta you gotta you gotta. Cause it's, a, it's called a male carrier bag. Look it up. It's a telegram. It's a male telegram in here for you. You gonna see it? Gonna get scope on that motherfucker for sure. I wear backpacks. The one yeah. with the teeth. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but that's okay. But that's, yeah, man. And the, oh, oh, on the side, yeah, I mean, if y'all hear another deep voice, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That, that's my brother, you know what I mean? Mar in the back, you know what I mean? He in the cut, you know what I mean? He's going to come through, yeah, showing yeah, some love. Yeah, yeah. But he got his fit on, too. He going crazy with the fit, you know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean? You want to get <laughs> fit, check? <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> Aye, aye. Yeah, yeah, nah, nah, nah. Appreciate you. Nah, nah, nah. For sure. Shout out to Smacky. Shout out. Can't wait till we reach 100,000. Come on. 100,000. We up. We up. Let's we speaking that into so, it. Yeah, so, time. man, appreciate everybody, man. Love, like, share. Please love, like, share. Comment, get in here. Comment. Get in here. Get in here. Reading all comments. For sure, for sure. So let's get back into it, Ray. So what you got, what do you have out now? Like what music do you have out now? Like do you have anything new out? Are you working on anything right now? I don't have anything new out right now. I've really been sitting on a lot of music. Um, I've just been going through a lot personally. So, Mm -hmm. I mean, I've definitely been in the space to write, but I'm just not in the space to promote, if that makes sense. Right, right. So, get out here and do more so I'm gonna just butt in if I can. Absolutely. There's always space to promote. There's always space to just let this shit fly because we're promoting we're, right and now. What the fuck is holding you back? Well, I'm promoting right now because I love Ellie. Nah, fuck that. Like, <laughs> it's about her. It's about your music too. Well, as far as my music, I'm not mentally there to promote myself in the capacity of what I like to promote myself as. So what's gonna happen? How am I gonna happen? If you put out a song, what if you put I'm out? Not. What if you put out a, a, a cover? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What if you put out put out a cover track, and then somebody see it like, oh my god, this is the next thing to fucking Jill Scott or you know what I mean? And so they got like, Jill Scott. And they, I, they, I, they, I they, 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 that's what I'm saying. So now, you it up. So the, no, you have to put it out to for to yeah. see where it can do. Don't be scared. Well, that's why I got the song out now. Go look at it and see that because it's a lot of people that don't know that music. You know what I mean? Right. Definitely, Ray got some good stuff out. Shout out to um YouTube page. YouTube, and, Ray, um, and Denise. Instagram, Ray the Way. That's R-A-E-T-H-E-W-A-E. Shout out to Way. Shout out to GBK. Shout out to Way. Shout out. Who else I shout out? Me. Shout <laughs> out my, my manager. Trees, yes. I do as much promo. Trees, say what's up. Let the people know who you are. I'm Trees. You can follow me at Instagram underscore Mocha underscore Bombshell. I am Ray's manager. I do as much promo as I can. Be at the show on Friday. So how did y'all meet? We're related. We're related. Yeah. Really? I'm the older cousin. She's older cousin. We just keep it in the family. You know what I mean? Mama side, daddy side. Sisters. sisters. Yep. Our mothers are sisters. sisters. Yes. We look just alike, don't we? (laughs) There (laughs) he is. Just alike. Twins. So, how does that dynamic work? Like, y'all just became good close cousins, or y'all been good close cousins? We became close cousins, like as we got older. I mean, yeah. we've always been around. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. I don't know how that works. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we've always, you know, did sleepovers and stuff mm-hmm. as little kids. But mm-hmm. you know, when we got older, we kind of developed that mm-hmm. sisterhood. Right. Mm-hmm. So she's more than my cousin. She's my sister. Mm-hmm. Aww. 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 Yeah. And then coming from a big family, you know what I'm saying? Like these is these are my people. These are. You know, my nieces or whatever. We got a big, big family. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of talent. Mm-hmm. You know, ever since Ray was little, I always told her she was a star. You know what I'm saying? So now seeing you doing your thing, you know what I'm saying? I'm definitely proud of you. And, you know, if any way that I can support you, you know, I'm all for it. Mm-hmm. I'm all for it. So let's, let's get the people a little sample. You know what I'm saying? Clear your throat real quick. <laughs> Let them know that you you yeah, from I want, I want local <laughs> restaurant. Yeah, right. You want a spot right, right. 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 now. You in the den? Mm. You're in the den. Yeah, it's hot in here. It's the den, son. 
Okay. Right. You gotta say it like that, like from the bro. It's the thin sun. It's the thin sun. It's the thin sun. Is you dumb? Is you, you dumb? dumb? Do you know my body? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know how I work? My body works. Just, like just like this. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Uh, I'll do. <laughs> I'll do a little bit of I know spot. my car. Yeah. Uh, seven more days and I'm just thinking about you and your face and how I want to just spin, spin the night with you. Oh, hurry and me sing in my car so I can get to you. It may be far, but I'll spin, spin the night with you. Just to hold you in my Just to spend a little time Just to let them know you're mine I Gas on E But I know my car it will Get me to where you are Tonight, tonight it will Oh yes Gas on E For the longest that this song definitely got a lot of potential. Like I used to play it over and over. Just the rough draft of it. It's a dope, dope song. Yes. Dope song. Here's one of the co-writers. Double, 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 double time for a reason. Double time. Oh, two of them. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Yes, guys. Uh, Treese was one of the co-writers on that song. Mm -hmm. So when she does get her accolades, she gonna get some too. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna put it out there, not the same though, but uh, you know. My my brother over here is family members too, you know, the biggest, the BSF people oh, and all that like that. Yeah. I ain't gonna say who and not what, but you might wanna tune into what, you know what I mean? Oh, I'm tapping. Tapping, tapping. To the biggest, right? Okay. Shout out to BSF, shout out to BSF, shout out to Drum So A Dark and Ray is very, very Talented. Shout out so, to my bro. I'm gonna say <coughs> shout out to my bro Rick Kai. Happy birthday. Shout out to my bro CG. Yeah, you know I mean, shout out to y'all. Same yeah. birthday. Yeah, we went to CG party. That was dope. We went to a little, you know what I mean, Papa joint. That was dope. That's what's up. You should have been there because they had like an open cypher. That's what I know. That would have been dope. Yeah. You could have got on the mic. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 I was trying to get with you get on the mic. He was being a real baby. You know what? Baby Jack. How you doing it? Listen. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. You are not alone. Okay, I'm like bring her, bring her. I am here. <laughs> okay. They, they was, listen, they was calling people out hard. They was, really? Like, she was calling people really out, but I, it wasn't even like that. I didn't, you know. It's still, it was still, where was the location? I ain't, I, I'm not. It was downtown. I'm a podcaster more or less now. Right. 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 But, but you can't right. speak. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Was that, I thought I saw um, a mirror, but that wasn't him. I can do the damn thing. Do it, man. Yeah, for sure. The when we went to the the show that time to see uh Miss Nikki. Mary. When we saw the comedy show. Oh, oh the guy. Oh the, the guy. Yeah. Did he rap? Oh Mari. Oh Mari. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what I was saying. No, he don't rap. I think he just yeah. played and sang. Okay, so Ray, you definitely got some stuff coming up. Yes, I've been. Do. You know, on your Facebook page or whatever, and I definitely try to promote, you know, whatever yes. it is that I see. And I will definitely be in the place. Ray, let them know what you got coming up. I will be at the Varsity Theater, Bailey Avenue, on May 26th. It's actually the day after my birthday, so we're going to be celebrating too. Oh, shit, I'm, I'm opening up for uh, Daniel D.P. Powell on drums. He be ripping it. So if you like live music, come out. Support, sing along. You'll know some songs. You'll not know some songs. It's just good music in general. For sure. sure. For sure. Definitely pull up, pull up. Good time, good music. Mm -hmm. Some dope artists. I've been to, what, maybe one or two of your shows. Mm -hmm. right? And it's always good. Live band. The band is dope. Blessing. Sounds of the culture. Shout out Sounds of the culture. So if you like, if you like good live music, they hit. You know what's crazy too? Um, 
Even though we live, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna say it right now. Shout out to my bro Genesis, man. Get well. Shout get, out get, to get Genesis. Well, Yo. But, um, yeah, he's this the person man. that like I'm gonna have to like link y'all with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that'll be uh, dope. He's, he's one Genesis of those. Genesis can blow, bro. Really? Yeah, he, 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 yeah, he, like he can, like for real, for real. Right, man. I cool. want that. And he's a dope ass rapper too, artist too. That nigga is multi faceted, multi talented. You know, we just want to get well. We, we in get our well, prayers yeah. and everything. You know get what I mean? Get well, and get well. We prayers just gonna up. Keep pushing through, but yeah, I'm gonna tap in y'all next because. That uh, his group go by Four Below. I don't know if y'all ever heard of Four Below. It sounds familiar. Them niggas is like the R and B boys to men of Buffalo. Them niggas is nice. What? I need to hear this. I'm intrigued. I can't even whistle that high too. Shallow drive. You like? Is it shot o'clock yet? Oh yeah, yeah. We shot o'clock. And then I will switch it up a little bit because I'm I'm interested in in you know asking uh. Chantrice from Questions, I'm sorry, I almost called you your nickname. That's okay. Everybody call me that anyway. As you should. They really do. What's the nickname? It's a weird one. Tweety. Tweety. I don't know where that came from. I really don't. You should look like a bird. You look like a little chocolate little Tweety bird. Chocolate Tweety bird. She's a little little cabbage patch song. I only seen one picture of me when I was like a baby. For real, I never seen it. Sylvester Cat. All right, everybody, shots up. Oh, I took my shot. God damn it. All right, I think everybody took. You took your shot. What? He's, 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 everybody, everybody, watch. We need to synchronize our watches because it's like, yeah, watch. I took my shot. It's a heist. I took my early, but yeah, shots up, ladies. Shots up. It's all good. All right, so Tui, I got a couple questions for you, Sean Trees. Sure. So, nervous. No, no, don't be nervous at all. It's cool. So, um, you write. How long have you been doing that? Uh, I only write on occasion. Like, if Ray is in a state where she's stuck, mm. I, like, try to help her get out of that. Mm. So, that's I don't nice. really, like, write, write. Like, that's not my thing at all. So, <laughs> so what is your thing? As, as... It's got to be oh, something. Right. right. Yeah, right. Multiple are things. you multiple Are you more so like the business? So what I know about Sean Trees, you know what I'm saying, this tweet you know, or tweet, tweet. Tree, tweet. you know what I'm saying, I will say that, you know, the my younger, you know, little nieces and, you know, family members or whatever, they be about their business. For sure. You know what I'm saying? This young lady right here is definitely about her business, homeowner. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Good ass job about that bag. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like I gotta, I gotta give respect where respect is due. Get more of the camera. Okay. Yeah, you need. I'm missing my head. On. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, got into the camera now. Uh, yeah, got into the camera. As long as y'all hear my voice, I'm, I'm near. Sorry, I can't pull it off, but yeah. But no, nah, so um, what led you to becoming her manager? Just the family aspect. I feel like I'm the one that she could trust the most out of anybody, and I know her like the back of my hand. Like. So, so <laughs> did you like come to her and say, "I want you to be my manager," or was it just one of those cousin? <laughs> <laughs> it was. Not, a, it was a cousin right. conversation. <laughs> 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 After, after three sh- three glasses of wine, bitch, you can sing. You know you, you, you can sing. You sang. No, I, I definitely asked her, but once you know, I asked her, she was down, and she's been excelling ever since. So funny story I remember about y'all too. This is back Twitter days. Oh, so, please no. Ray used to be obsessed with Chris Brown. Uh, uh, oh, no. <laughs> they posted, Yo, they did like a whole that. song and video. It's actually fire. Like, got a bunch of views <laughs> harassing Chris Brown, no. trying to get him to follow them back. <laughs> On Twitter, that, we gotta no. watch that. Yeah. Can yeah. we edit that in here? So no, we, 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 listen, if I could edit it in here, I would. But it's hilarious. Fine. You got Tweety on the background vocal. What was it? What was really when I seen that video, my room? Yeah, it was yeah. Marvin's room. Yeah, it was instrumental. Yeah. 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 But when I, 
when I seen this video, I was like, yo, they, that's kind of hot. They kind of got it. They go on with something. This is this the master of, of remixing people's songs. Oh, word. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm not part of the Brown Beetle community. <laughs> <laughs> I'm part of the Brown Beetles. Brown Beetles. Chris Brown Beetles. They call them Brown Beetles? I don't, I don't like that. that Brown Beetles? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Brown Beetles. Who do they call them? Team Breezy. Yeah. Y'all was Breezy's? They were Breezy. Oh, you're not. Y'all was Breezy. They was Breezy. Breezy. I know Breezy. You was a Breezy. You was a Breezy. You ain't a Beetle. You were Breezy. Yeah, you gotta be one or the other. I'm still a Beetle. You're not a Beetle. You're like, I'll be Beetle. She'll be Breezy. Okay. I'm weird. So that's what was on the point no, to but that's like, that's I like remixing people's songs. No, but I like remixing shit. Like what you were saying. I'm not yeah. going to cut you off, but I like to remix shit in a fun, loving way. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I like to remix shit in a fun, loving way. I like to remix shit in a fun, loving way. Almost like a weird out Yankovic type of shit. Okay, that's fine. Like, you know, so yeah. like, um, what, what was my one drug that I had? Uh, uh, oh my what was the other one? I was just saying this day. Um, oh, uh, because you know, niggas yeah. is bitches too. Oh, <laughs> wow. Niggas be pillow talking. <laughs> yeah, niggas be pillow talking. I mean, oh, 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 yeah, that's kind of like the, the pigeons, no scrub. Yeah, I don't want no pigeons. Right. Remember, like the pigeons, right? right. Yeah, yeah, right. You know the one that Cardi, right. uh, not Cardi B. What's the what's the bitch name? Um, Coilerette. Coilerette. Okay, yeah, yeah. Because girls be players too, but nah, but yeah, niggas, yeah, yeah. niggas be pillow talking around the world. Record that. That'd go viral. Really talking. Yeah. Yeah. You don't do TikTok. I don't do a TikToker. That's I'm true. trying to get with TikTok. I gotta say it in an old way because I'm an old nigga. Sixteen fever. You know how your TikTok. parents used to say shit Ooh, wrong just you? because, mm -hmm. right? Like you know, like what would it be like a VHS tape or something like that. Mm -hmm. Put the put the reel on the movie scroll thing <laughs> in the box with the thing that moves. On the picture. Yeah, on the picture. like you know it. Like, it's, a, it's a VHS tape. It's a movie. But you want to go all around this shit, just not to say what it is. I know you be watching E T T. What the fuck is E T T? B E T. I'm out. What? That type of shit. You feel me? All right. All right. All right. So, um, Tweety, what? Like I said, what are some of the other things that you do as a manager for Ray? Like, what does that job consist of? Okay, so we know that you assist her in writing. Mm hmm. You make sure that, you know, she booked and busy or whatever, you be on top of that. That's part of the agreement. For the most part. Ray really is really good with that. I just like really advise her like certain things to post, mm -hmm. like what not to post, what's a good idea. Ideas I run through her to see if she like it. Right. At the end of the day she's the artist. I tell her what's, you know, mm -hmm. cool, I guess, right mm -hmm. now, trending, mm -hmm. what she, would go. If she tell me something, I'm like that ain't it. But, like, I feel like if it wasn't me, if I wasn't her cousin, if it was somebody else, they'll be like, yeah, that's good. I'm like, nah. Don't right, you gotta be yeah. real. honest. So. But you right. ain't being a major pain. Yeah, no. No, no, no. You, oh. need, you, no. Know, you <laughs> need to start being a major pain. You need to be her bikini and what? her thong. Oh. All, her of her, yeah, say, yeah, all of her. All of her. Right. You can't yeah. that up. Yeah. 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 You need to be her sheets when she but get she... off the bed and it's between her butt cheeks and you just. Oh, it's cool no. up. That's how you eat. You need to be like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like <laughs> real for He's been doing good though. Like, Ray has really been looking. You need to be booking her shows. You need to be booking open mics. You need to just mm -hmm. expose, I'm expose. Working. You need to tell her, <laughs> fuck the, the whole this shit, release, release, release. release? You need yeah. to find the fucking, um, the, uh, God damn it, I can't think of the name. The, the, uh, the multifaceted platforms to promote this shit. True, you no. Need to make sure We've been coming mean, up with ideas, it's just that. You need to make sure all the T's are crossed and all the dies uh, the the are, are dyed. Oh yeah, for sure. If you're a manager, this is, true. this is what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to, as much as she's the artist, as big as she gonna get, and not, not get, excuse me, as big as she's growing to get, right. as strong as you need to be a manager. Because you know what? You, Absolutely. You can start with one artist and take on five more. So could you see yourself possibly in the future managing multiple artists? Cause I'm saying I because you started, you got Ray. So, okay, Ray blows up and becomes successful. 
You know what I'm saying? Now your yeah, name. Is, now your, I'm just saying. Now your name is out there. I can speak on yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. Because I always tell her how great she is. She doesn't feel it, and I always tell her like you could really oh, yeah. expand on she this. Is. Like, she got I, if you got me on your roster, that's just top tier, respectfully. What? But you could add more people and get an even bigger band. But the, just the fact that you have an established artist. You know what I'm saying? And Ray is an established artist. That speaks a lot. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And you can grow on that. She's you know, it. you just got a network. You more. got it, baby. Me and Ray had a conversation. I'm just being honest. Mm-hmm. I told her that this, I am not for the industry. Like, that's not what I. No, fuck it, that. That's you not what the I want to do. No, like, no. That's not really my. But that's okay, her okay, calling. Okay, like, okay, I'm just okay. here because I love her. I know she can trust me. And I'll make sure she can. But you got But see, this is the thing about it. Okay. No. <laughs> okay, so can I give some advice? Okay, so you got to take the. I'm not saying not love your family. Mm-hmm. But when it comes to the business, you need to kind of push that to the side because this is the, this is the business aspect of it. Right. Okay. When the. Shit get real when, you know, she got more bookings, it's a more demand for her music mm-hmm. and all that kind of stuff like that. Then what you gonna do? You gonna bow out because you're not for the industry? No. no you you the you manager. Not. You're the manager. You gotta take the high. So you gotta manage. like you can't you can't have that shit. It's like either right. you in or you out. That is true. You and know she did say that. Yeah. And you gotta not be timid or, or not. She's not, not. Not, not saying you're timid. I don't I'm know. Not. You. Listen, I'm <laughs> just speaking off I'm just I'm just going right. to I I'm think that it's more so this aspect that that you feel a little more timid in because you don't feel like you have the experience. Yeah, I can't relate. I feel like I can't relate because I'm not a music... Like, I have an ear for music. She said that before. She said I could be an AR, all this other stuff. But it's like... Ain't my passion. So right. it's like I feel like I can't get my all because it's not my. So what is your passion? I, I'm really like an entrepreneur. I have like five different business ideas in my so head right now. I mean, you don't got to tell us your business ideas. What are you actually doing right now? Right now, I'm working on makeup. I'm trying to be a, a makeup artist and seasonal picnics. I'm doing that right now. Like I have two picnics set up to like luxurious picnic type things. So that'll just be a seasonal thing. Just to earn some extra cash, but no, like you could do it. Well, I'm investing you, could do in it, you could actually do it yearly. It's just you gotta base it in places. Right, right places. So when you say seasonal, uh, is it like for a specific holiday, or is it for throughout the year? Like It'll be said. like a spring, summer, and then like a summer, fall. Like those okay. that season, you know. But you can expand on that. You can do birthday. Yeah, like. My goal is to start small and then expand. And then I'm also an investor. Like right now I'm investing into my cousin's speaker business. Undivided Society, shout out. Shout out, UBK. shout out, E, no shout out, E. Gotta get you on. No way. The merch no is way. crazy. It definitely. is. Crazy. I gotta get some pieces uh, and definitely uh, show someone so, one of our fit techs. For sure. yeah. I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all like this, right? And y'all can whatever, whatever, whatever. Mm-hmm. No time right now. With everything, mm-hmm. same way I tell her about her podcast. No time right now. Right. Don't be fierce later, cause you fierce now. Mm-hmm. If some shit wrong with your household, you gonna correct that shit right away, right? True. Mm-hmm. If some shit wrong with your relationship, you gonna correct that right away, right? Mm-hmm. That's so, a good one. Why, so why not? <laughs> so why not? Take that same shrimp and energy and apply right. it to some worthwhile appliance. This is true, though. And this is on both parts. I'm not just speaking. I'm just speaking in general to everybody in the room. Mm-hmm. You right. know what I mean? Why not apply that energy? Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Take those mm-hmm. those doubts and faults that we all have and we be thinking, ah, I can't. Oh, oh, I might not fuck that. <laughs> Try that. Not this is true, but I always that same energy that you put in, but that same energy that you put in into doubting yourself. Right. You could put right. that same energy into working on the craft. I'm not gonna rant on that. You know what I'm saying? You you are going to fail. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's going. It's it, it's happening. It's bound. It's bound to happen. Mm-hmm. But it's how you take it and what you learn from it. Right. And then you come back stronger. You learn what not to do. Mm-hmm. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? So. And and basically, you said by AD, like I said, I'm not going to rant on it nothing like that. Mm-hmm. But I just basically wanted to say, like, at the end of the day, whatever you try, if you fail, so what? 
if you wake up the next day. Right. If you try some shit and you die, then you fail all the way. Yeah. Fucking loser. Yeah. No, I just say <laughs> Game over. Game over. <laughs> 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 Nah, but you know what I mean? Like, yeah. You know what I mean? What the hell are you trying? You're dying. Listen, wherever you go, you better die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. You smell crack, don't you? <laughs> Do it expeditiously. You smell crack, don't you? Yes. Yes. Yo, that's a man. Yeah, y'all wild. Definitely. So I'm feeling that Tweety for sure. I'm I'm proud of you. Definitely keep up the good work. Ray, definitely keep up the good work. So, you know, it's the end of the weekend. It's Sunday night. How was everybody's weekend? Wow. Ain't it right? Yeah. <laughs> Wow. It was wild. It was wild. It was, it was wild. Y'all had a wild weekend. What did y'all do? We had, we did, what did we do? Drink too much. Yep. And listen to early 2000s music. Period. We was bumping like Kangy and Jay-Z. I love it. Avril Lavigne. Y'all was chicken heading. Yeah. In the car. In the car. Drop down to get the eagle on. Oh, yeah. Get the eagle on, girl. Out of control. It was out of control. It was. Like me. made a at the Nugget. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. I have been to the Nugget in about 15 years. Ooh, don't go, I'm telling you. Right. No, don't worry. Listen. I went to the Nugget and felt like I was 15. Like, I mean, <laughs> and listen, I probably should have been in there when I was in there. This shit weak. <laughs> this was, yeah. <laughs> the old heads, the old bills. No, nah, it's just when you when you party out of town, you club out of town. It's, it's, it's different. It's different. It's way different. Like, different. Like, we come back home like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. it's a and I think and I think that's what it is. That's the whole different experience when you out of town. You right. know, you used to what's going on here. So right. when you go out of town, it's just you know a whole different feeling, a different environment. You know. But speaking about being in a different environment, you ever been to a club? I mean, I don't give a fuck. I'm not ashamed. I'm 40. I'm, I'm happy to be my age. I don't give a fuck. But you ever been to a club where it's like 21 and over right now? And it's like, damn, I don't belong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Right. This shit yeah. is nasty. It's crazy because, I mean, I'm 27. She's 28. Yeah. Um, we're in our 30s. Racket, but so y'all been in clubs basically with 18 and up. Yeah, right. it ain't it. That's nasty. Yeah. That's nasty. I'm trying to get the job. Right. Yeah. I definitely like a, a more laid back crowd. You know, I want to turn up a little bit every now and then, but for the most part, when I walk in and see, you know, ah! My, oh, if I see y'all, if I see y'all, I'm ready. I'm finna go. <laughs> I don't got time for this. I'm out of here. But I could do 27. Yeah, so I, I could do 27. 21. 22. Mm-hmm. 21 to, I'd say 25. 21, give you something for me. <laughs> but it's like, <laughs> the, <laughs> the, the, the age that we're at right now, we can't even get into certain spots. Like, right. we got 30 and up, and it's right. like, come on, we right there. Right. You can't right. let us in. Like, you just win. We knocking on 30. Listen, I'm trying to tell you, I mean, I get there, it's, it's same motherfuckers that we already see you know, <laughs> <laughs> down the street. So it's you know, it's you know, totally, you know, especially you here. Right. Mm-hmm. right. You you're not gonna see nothing mm-hmm. different. Ain't nothing different. Ain't nothing special. It's just older. That's it. That sucks. Well, I mean, we we right. I mean, this is making it to the joint. Well, look, you think nope. it would be safer, but they still with the dumb shit. What? We're going home. Right? <laughs> no point even being outside. Game night at the crib. Wind down. Mm-hmm. That's even more dangerous. At the bring, crib? You bring out the Tramana. What's the Tramana? The, the tequila, yeah, Tramana and, oh. and the tequila. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, no, no. You talking about Henny, that Tramana, that shit is a fight. Oh, that's that's real. She said it's right. Nope. Let me see what they said. Yeah, it's the life. That's the rock shit, Tramana. Oh, the rock. I never had that. The yeah. Wayne Johnson. Yeah. What? What is Tramana? Wait, Johnson. That sounds crazy. I had the Snoop wine. We never had. That is. 
No, thank you. It wasn't. I perfect. agree. <laughs> I got some in the refrigerator down you there. Did? It's I'm terrible. I'm trying to support dying lives. Nine, 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 wait, how many? It's 19 crimes. Nine lives. My husband was a dog. He laughed He didn't want to shit now. What is it called? He put me on the wine. He might put y'all on some wine and shit. Are you? I need a new type of wine. Something like that? Nigga, yeah. stop for me for you. Yeah. 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 You be a monitor. Right. Never had no wine. Ever. So what? What uh, would be a good sweet wine that you would oh, recommend? You know I you like sweet. Not pause, right. like not pause. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't be like pause. Because you know I don't fuck with no blue chicks. So yeah, had you this. watch a lot of uh, yeah, back on uh, things. That's a good one y'all had right there. What the blue chick? Oh, the nine nine nine. That's good. Oh, mango tango. Mango Tango, I never had that. That's why I recommend for you. That's juice. I gotta try that. Juice. Mango Tango. What it says it is sweet. It's damn juice. It is. On the bottle, we got the man and the girl, they dancing. Mm -hmm. That shit going out and doing that. All right, Mango Tango. Y'all want the good, good, sweet, fruity vibes? I don't know. Niggas will send me a case too, man. Talk about Mango Tango. Listen. That sounds good. I'm trying to go try that. A wine tour? I don't want to do that. What's that shit? Never been to a wine tour? Calypso? Calypso? That shit was wild. That shit was like a fucking soap or so. That shit was nasty. It's like a... Uh, or Capas... What's that? We got Capas... Capriccio? It might be like... Capriccio? No, this is Capriccio. 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 Oh, oh, my God. God. That's like liquor. That shit was sweet as nasty. It was nasty. I would never drink that. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. That's like drinking a Ford Loco. Okay. I ain't doing that. I ain't doing that since high school. Ooh, a Ford Loco. Oh, Ooh, my God. God. I know somebody who's... Some of the worst somebody days of my life. Somebody a Ford Loco. On the Ford Loco. They didn't ban that. Who named the Ford Loco? That's me. I had one poor loco in my life. I only had one too. I never drank it again. I never I had one time. Blue raspberry in my piss. I had gray. My piss came Stand. out. Lake Erie Green. <laughs> Yo, that means Lake wow. Erie Green. Though. You know, Lake Erie Green, but that shit was like <laughs> Erie. I never had a full loco. Man, that shit was nasty. You never had a full loco before? Really? Not even high school? Oh, girl. Uh, I'm talking about not the, not the, not the, not the fixed up for a loco. I'm talking about the old first edition where that shit was like 11 and a half percent alcohol. Yeah, that shit was nasty. 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 Yeah, I don't want to get too far off topic here, but you know my weekend was good and all that. We went fishing. We didn't do too much. Um, we had a little competition today. I did good. I caught what about. You I caught about five or six. You got them? Yeah, I got. Them. You got no, them? we threw them back. Oh. <laughs> wait, 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 what? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And right now, ready? Ready to go. Little potato salad. No, they would go. <laughs> nah. What's the name of the thing that I that we was catching out there before? He actually, he technically only caught one real fish. Why are you talking? It was a fake one. Why are you speaking for me? I just want to say that before he started running his mouth, like it was only one guy. Technically, it was only one fish. We, we, we caught some go bays. <laughs> <laughs> go bays are go bees are yeah. bottom feeders and they're nasty bird. And you throw them shit to the seagulls. He caught some yeah. big black nasty yeah. looking charcoal yeah. yeah. black <laughs> like an eel. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was slimy. Where that black thing? Slimy and grimy. Oh, it's the good. bottom of the bottom. What and, area uh, was y'all at? Like? The lake, like I said. Oh, that's right. mm, so yeah. Yeah. It was fun though. Mm -hmm. It was that's fun. Right. I, I went fishing. Fish. I went fishing one time. I didn't catch nothing. I was gonna go fishing again. I, I, had, fishing. You know, I, I caught like I ain't touching nothing. I caught like ten of them bitches. Yeah. I caught, caught like, like ten of them. A big nasty black looking joint. I ain't even want to handle the oh, shit. That shit was nasty. Well, I can just like imagine. I really can just imagine how it looked. Like, hey, look, it was look, a lake. Look, 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 so imagine. Look, so a gobi is like. You ever heard of a mud skipper? GMO fish. Okay, so like a mud skipper is like. Is half fish, half human. Don't you? <laughs> so basically, yes, it has th this front front. It fin. got four it fins. Can, it like can walk it on can... water. Really? What? What? Not, yeah, it's got. It, it can move and it's move itself fish. in water. Okay. Oh, I mean, not water. Excuse me, land. I'm a little tipsy. Excuse me, man. Yes. 
They can maneuver itself in land. Like a water chupacabra. Oh, yeah. not Don't start with that chupacabra shit. Yeah. So it's, it's a nasty, it's, it's a body <laughs> That's a so story for another even, time. Even me getting off the hook, like, Government yeah, it's so it. slimy and disgusting because it's the bottom of the bottom. Like we see, like how did you catch that? Like if it was at the bottom, yeah, like it, 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 it hooked him up. But what I'm saying is, like Lake Erie's so nasty, right? They don't tell us what we like. Everybody catch that. What do we see in the Like a condom. It was a condom. It was a needle. This is why we was fishing, y'all. So y'all want to eat a condom floating up? If y'all eating that fish. Don't. Yeah, don't those two it. right there was like, bye, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't. You're not doing it. Let's pour mm-hmm. it to the Pour it to the clean lady. Yeah, that's not a good lady. Yeah, not a good lady. Mm-hmm. But, um, anyways, Cheers. love is hard. But anyway, um. We still drinking, y'all? So yeah, I had to um, uh, finish that story y'all real quick. I caught the biggest fish, bong bong, the last fish of the day. It was a big ass black bass, and she was like this big. Mm-hmm. It was like as wide as my hand. That's it was. Yeah. It was. It was, it was black cool. Bass. We had five. Yes. It was a bass, but mm-hmm. it has like blackish kind of scales in it. Mm-hmm. No, no, no. That was an actual evil fish. That was an actual evil fish. Wait, bass? Well, you still don't want to um, eat it? was swimming you know, in the water with the condom. I would never. <laughs> right, right. Why would you do that? Somebody can't. Oh, I got lakes, and there's still not enough to cleanse that semen that's in that lake. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 I'm about to throw up. You know, <laughs> you're saying, if you're eating from Lake Erie, you're a nasty son of a mother. You're a nasty woman. You're a nasty woman. You're a nasty woman. You're a nasty woman. I'm not kissing it twice, but I'm just saying. All right, all right, guys. You're nasty. Hey, it's life. You Poor see lake. water, you pee water. Oh, my God, no. Poor Lake. All right. <laughs> Next subject. Moving on. Moving along. All right, Ray, so let's get back to you. So tell me, who are some of the artists that inspired you as far as, like, your sound? My sound. Mm-hmm. Michael Jackson. Mm-hmm. Number one. Mm-hmm. Uh, the Brothers Johnson. Black Michael Jackson Ooh, or White Michael Jackson? Jackson. All Michael Jackson. Yeah. 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 All the Michaels. Mm-hmm. Black, white. <laughs> in between. In between. Light skin Mike. Yeah, he was in here. Yeah. Um, mm-hmm. I listen to everybody. Um, Victoria her. Monet, she's another she's artist that, that is like an inspiration for me. Her mm-hmm. kid is crazy. She wrote for like Ariana Grande. She wrote a... Uh, Oh, and that's just how we do it. Like really? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, I mean, really, my family. Honestly, that's where I really get my musical taste, interest. What y'all talking about? I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I'm enjoying it. They haven't signed. They haven't signed. He got the old block. Oh my! King right now. I'm sorry. What Y'all can't see him over here in the corner. He in the cut. That's the only thing. Why yo? Why yo? King Why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What he signed to Dirk? He was with Dirk. I don't know who he was. Who was he signed to? Not Little Dirk. King Von. Yeah, he was signed to Little Dirk. What's his O-T-F. 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 Oh, okay. Rest in peace, rest in peace. No disrespect. Yeah, not at all. Never that. I'm oh, sorry. Yeah, it's all love. Like, but yeah, my inspirations uh, vary. And it, my inspiration musically really comes from my family because they listen to everything. And growing up, I was exposed to everything. So Absolutely. just music as a whole, mm-hmm. I'm inspired by everybody. Mm-hmm. But Michael, top tier, number one. So who is your go to artist like? What's an album that you can pull out right now and listen to the whole thing, front to back? Off the Wall, Michael Jackson. Oh, that's a good one. That was easy. Yeah, super <laughs> easy. Off the Wall, for sure. Um, keep, keep pulling my curl down in front. Uh, Stevie Wonder, Songs in the Key of Life. Mm. That's another one. Mm. Mm. See how I'm talking about. Yes. Stop playing. <laughs> Well, no, because did you see the video with the microphone? Yeah, I can see for real, man. The yeah. microphone oh, fell. Yeah. You saw it for it. Yeah. He heard. That's, they got super sensitive. They, they heard it. will be high. So he, he probably heard. heard. Like he was like, pecan. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like a... <laughs> it's like, I'm Steve. I'm gonna What's say, up? This, he said it's so serious he can see. He can see. He just drove a car. It's on YouTube. No, he didn't drove a car. Stevie Wonder. No, he didn't. He did voice control. 
But you know that Tesla's. I don't right. give a shit. Shout out Tesla. I mean, Shout out Tesla. You got behind the steering wheel. As a con man. That's his character. You can hear the con man. Yo. Stevie Wonder's a character now. Just I mean, it sounds good. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, Rest in peace. Well, I know that uh, Stevie Wonder was, was having like a lot of surgery <laughs> and stuff on his <laughs> eyes. He was. Oh, who Ray? No, Stevie Wonder. Stevie Wonder was having surgery and stuff on his eyes. So he probably could see like that. I think he was grabbing by the wrist. If I'm right. wrong, I don't mean no disrespect, but I do think he's juicy. What's that? Yeah. 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 I just know somebody finds them. If they skin is soft. So oh. he, Ray Charles, he used to go by the size right. of the wrist. The mm. size or the feeling? Like, the size. Like, oh, oh, baby, yo, 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 yeah, I'm gonna start doing that with you. Tell me, nah, look, 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 look. Only thing I can do is to him was back in the days. There wasn't no trainee dandies back then like that. Oh, so oh now he can get away with it. Nowadays, the trainee dandies, excuse me. So how you did is walk up to him and like rub him? Nah, hell nah. I'm just saying, and I like that. Listen, I come in peace. I come in peace. No disrespect to the LGBT community. All love. I'm saying it was no, you know, I mean, they and them back then. Let me say it right. There was no they and them back then like that. So or however you express that nigga be in Miami. That nigga done rubbed the wrist. Stop it. I'm This episode, guys, left field. I'm loving it, but Ooh, you play athletic <laughs> stuff, baby. Ooh, this is a basketball player, huh? <laughs> May 26th. So, right, May 26th. Right. That is, guys. Theater. Keep that in mind. We got 10 more minutes. We're going to go for an hour and then we're going to jump off of here. Please. So, on that same note, right? So, He's tell me one of the songs that you already have out. Which one do you feel like is inspired most by one of those artists that you mentioned? Or is it like a mix? It's all a mix. It's all a mix. It's all a mix. Uh, what's the song Stay In? Yes. I love the intro to that video where it's like you oh, saying that you had a song with Michael. Listen, y'all gotta definitely go on YouTube and check out Ray's music. She got some good hot videos on there. Um, In My Mind, is that the name of it? Yes. With you and Joshua. Joshua. Joshua, shout out to Joshua Viganti. I heard dope, that song. Dope I artist. Heard that song. I like that. Dope, I dope artist. You put me on that song. Good that music, song. good music, for like sure, for sure, for sure. Very rich song. Okay. So do you do ratchet music? I can. I don't really. So I <laughs> had the idea. So I had the idea. Remember, Ray, when we talked about it, I was saying you should do the summertime song. Yeah. Uh, remember I was saying that how much I like the song Float? And I yes. was saying, kind of like go off a vibe like that, you know what I'm saying? Kind of like where you popping this shit, you know yeah. what I'm saying? You know, the city is hot, you looking good, you know, whatever. One of them songs. Thinking, One of them I'm songs. I'm thinking you got to get a little bit more deep. What you saying is we I ain't think. doing no Suki. What? No, not like type. That. Not like that. Okay. Not like that. No, no, no. Suki be doing. You want to switch? That's my girl. I fuck with Suki, but we not honest. 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 What, what, what Ellie is saying is not wrong. What I'm saying is, like, you need to do more, like, uh, um, uh, um, damn, she fucked me up. Uh, <laughs> you need to do more in depth, like, um, the bone joint, like, uh, and Tasha, like, them joint, them type Tasha, of joint. Tasha, Tasha. And you know what I'm talking about, the bone oh, like, stuff. The bone <laughs> down. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta, yeah, yeah, like that, yeah, 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 you gotta get more, yeah, you gotta get more, yeah, more, yeah, 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 you know that's scary. But you still no. don't like the only like, video that scared me was that Busta Rhyme joint with Janet. I can't see with uh, me. Oh yeah, uh, the video did. We like scary y'all. That man was doing too much. <laughs> you know what? Yeah, they, he, he was, was green. Scared. His body. Yeah, I'm like scared. they used to be scared of the thrill. You know what I'm gonna say? That's yeah. who else scared of the thrill? I gonna do his eyes like that. 
Put the cat eye at the end. Nah. Yeah. Nah. Oh, nah, nah, but they have everybody. <laughs> I think collectively, collectively, I can bring some shit out. And yeah, like, yeah. we had a conversation. Y'all listen to Scarlet. I love her. I like Scarlet. Okay. I don't know what it's called. This is New York. This is New York. Hi, And right, it's a conversation that we'll have yes. at another time off yes. camera. But like I said, I definitely got some some things that I yeah, want to say. Yeah. Listen, you know? I need to collectively, if that's what you do, you know what I mean? I think you're, you're her writer or writer, right. but you help her in a sense because all people need help. Yeah, it's absolutely. Whatever. But this is just my input, just my thought. You need to get more tapped into the hood. You know what I'm saying? You need to help her get tapped into more of the First hood. First of all, I don't know I how much more you can get tapped in the hood. You yeah. in the hood oh, right it's now. Deep. It deep. We're in the hood right now. Right. We was just at, like I said, <laughs> <laughs> uh, shout out to my We in the hood. No, we in the hood. Right? Nah, nah. You see some, I'm talking about like the underground hip hop. Yeah, I know what you mean. For sure. Like, it's no, I'm tapped in with that as well. It's just something I don't want to do. Because no, actually, I'm not. You have to do it. Uh, yeah. That's it. That's, it's going to make you greater. You got to do everything. I'm just, I know like, you as an great. artist, period. Great. As an artist, you want to be well-rounded. Y'all know how right. I am. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you what I know. Right. Right. I know music. I have you know what I'm saying? And just to be well-rounded. You know what I'm saying? My just bro's fuck with my music. His bro's fuck with my music. His bro's make music. Right, right. You know what I'm talking about. I'm turning into that type of art. Right. You understand right. what I'm saying? So, no. yeah, absolutely. You, you absolutely. Wanna, That's what Tamara Shout out to Scarlett. For real. Like, I, I feel Scarlett. 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 She's fired. She's fired. Really she fire. really fire. And then, like, it's so funny, like, when you listen to her music, and it's, it's, it's so much aggression. She's and one reason why I, I feel like I relate to her because I always kind of get pegged this this, you know, kind of aggressive person. Now I'm not. But when you get it, when you listen to her music, you hear so much aggression. But then when you talk to her as a person, like if you ever watch any of her interviews or whatever, she's so <laughs> humble. You know what I'm saying? It's so sweet. You know what I'm saying? But it's Shout inner. Scarlett. It's inner. Shout out Scarlett. Like, I just wanted to now, pump that I'm, out there. I'm, I'm champion her. Yeah, so champion I want to see her win. I know big things is coming. No doubt. No doubt. But Ray, I know it's big things coming for you as well. You know what I'm saying? I'm so happy to have y'all here. You know what I'm saying? We this has definitely it. been dope. We got a few more minutes before we reach our hour. So we're going to use this time to do our little sound off session that I've been talking about. And then later on down the line, guys, uh, Wave been talking about he want to do his little segment. What is it? Smoke break with Wave. And we're going to have crazy story time. That's something we're going to... I can't wait for that. Okay. Uh, listen, <laughs> oh, I don't even think I'm ready. <laughs> that might just be she, something where he just so sit here and y'all smoke. The spot. And that's funny you said that. So as soon as you said that, <laughs> now nah, it, it brought me to the story and I got my brother here. Oh, uh, so, here we go. So we got a story. Smoke break away. Yeah. You got to light up because this is smoke yeah. break away. No, we're going to go into that, but we're going to light up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we got a story real quick. We, gonna, we ain't going to go too, too much longer. It's, 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 yeah, it's, 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 we at 57, you know what I'm saying? So if anybody got something that they want to talk about, then I'll do my last question that I ask. And May 26, the Varsity Theater. Varsity Theater, definitely. Yeah. The show starts 7 p.m. Uh, link, we will throw it in the comments somewhere. Click the link, okay. purchase tickets, or at the door, whichever you prefer. May 26. May 26. May 26. Tweet. I got something to say. Okay. Um, oh, she said she got something to say. Going I'm currently here. doing faces for 20 and 40. If you want to vote glam, that's 40. If you want a basic soft glam, that's 20. It's just a sit and see. I'm still practicing, so put time aside. It's taking about two hours. I'm working on it. And I will be dropping the picnic brand real, real soon. Probably like in the so I want to say something about the makeup real quick. And this show is, I just want to put this out here real quick before I say what I got to say. This show is not directed for women or for men. It's, it's the den. Right. You know what I'm saying? Not like so, you know what I'm saying? So Definitely y'all get here. into it. Whatever, whatever. But for me, okay, uh, Tweety, with the whole makeup thing or whatever, mm-hmm. like, you know, I dibble and dabble a little bit. Mm-hmm. And I guess you could say, like, I have strong features. Mm-hmm. So... When I wear makeup, I have to be very careful because, you know, sometimes you can come off looking kind of drag queen. Yes, of course. So what is some of the advice that you can give for us beginning makeup 
wears or trying to wear. Because don't honestly, I really I don't have the most perfect skin in the world, but I swear, like I don't be trying to go through all of that. Don't I be trying to look cute from like doing stuff like that. It, <laughs> it sculpt your face, so don't do a harsh contour. Do like a soft, more natural type. Because I'm, I could attest to looking like a drag. She don't need no disrespect. No, I love my queens. I love, I love my queens, and I don't mind a beat face, but I want my face to be beat properly. Right, I don't want to be looking like a clown, right, or crazy. No, right, yeah, because we do have those cheekbones that be like, okay, we don't want to come off the top. No makeup. No makeup. So you're a natural man. What about the high right, pigmentation? That's like, what they be saying. They, saying. they be saying that, that, but when you... Yeah, yeah but I'm... So... See, that's... We can go another hour. <laughs> but I ain't that so right now. So what do they go for? Do they not wear frontals? They don't have their eyebrows done? They're not... No, it's a certain amount. Like me, I definitely like my eyebrows done. I love my, you know, my nails and stuff done like that. Now, depending on what the occasion is. Let's talk about, so we're going to go there. I'm sorry. Okay, no, go ahead. I want to hear what you're saying. We're going to talk about the male don't give a fuck. About what? We're about to give it to you. Before you, okay. Alright, here we go. Let's here we go. Here we go. Don't because we about to go over time. We about to go off live and then just continue the conversation. Because no, no, no. Yeah. We go. It's only at an hour. We're I an hour. I want to hear this. The good part. Mm, I want to hear this. this. The good part. Bullshit. We love, we love our queens. Listen, we love our queens. We love y'all natural. When y'all got the bush, bush, y'all know what you're talking about. Is you, you know what I mean? That that you like? Oh shit! I forgot time, time. It look like these patches on the wall. And what I'm saying <laughs> is, I love y'all. Right? Wow! Love y'all. Not Listen, the patches on the wall. Let me get it off. 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 We love y'all. We, we love y'all. When when your eyebrows is cookie bush gone, like them shit just just faded, and then you just etching them on with with little pencils and stuff like that. We love y'all. Not little too. pencils. We love y'all too, right? So oh I'm gonna get to God. it. I'm gonna get to it right now. <laughs> Please get to it. We love y'all, right? I want to hear about but these don't, don't give a fucks. We don't give a fucks about them goddamn lashes. <laughs> I need lashes. First of all, hold on. Let me get mine off, dog. Listen, I'm taking off. Let me take off because I'm, I'm about to get in the sky. You don't give a fuck about the lashes. Only time you even. give a fuck about the lashes is when they too much, when they look like these patches. And then I'm saying, they, they're too much. Everything is these patches on the wall. Everything is the patches on the wall. Sometimes you we don't see it. it. We don't see it. We don't see it. Look, look, hold on. Let me get it off. Let me get let it off. Him get, right? Please let me get it off. We love, we love when y'all get your nails done. It's wonderful, magnifique. But then you be like, yeah, I got my, my toes done too. We don't give a fuck. About <laughs> toes? Listen. Listen, it's nice. You're telling a bold face it's lie right, it's right nice. now. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. You know you like bold face lie. Cute and together. So it's you want nice. crusty feet on you? No, you want like, alligator no, toes? No, no, I'm, not, this, no, you I'm you taking off. Like, I'm taking off. Hold on. I'm taking off. I'm taking off. You're not This is one of the things that I'm taking off. Hold on. We don't give a fuck like a about the coloration. You that cut me off as soon as I said the feet. You're like feet, feet. Yeah. No, we love feet. We don't give a fuck about. We don't notice the, the color on your toes. Well, yeah. that's not for you to notice. Yes, but it is. Cause you put them up like this turn out, turn, cause in the it's air. Pretty. Cause it's cute. We don't it's give cute. a fuck. Hold on, can I? Get, I'm still but, taking off. But let me tell you how I'm this is so know. much of a double I'm standard. Because this, you because know, men don't say we don't give a fuck. Pause. Oh, men will say today. that they don't care about these things, but then when you don't do it on a bad day, oh, you don't let yourself go. Why you ain't done that? Why your toes ain't done? Why your nails get it together? Pull it together. What? I'm, Cause listen, to bring it back, what I'm saying is, I'm not, neg- I'm not negating. It sounds good. Listen, can I get mine up? I'm not negating anything women do. I love, we love it. I'm telling you what we don't give a fuck about. Okay, okay. Tell so me, scrap you. So you saying it's, it's just the color? I'm just trying to get understanding. Turn if they ain't painting their feet and stuff. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So of course now. Talk about that. As long as you since a listen, so. 
One, to bring it back to also, we don't give a fuck about how your baby hairs and all that shit look. No, that's, that's a lie. I don't really care for Cause that. you wouldn't, you wouldn't go out If my wig is not, is looking crazy, please tell, and it ain't a hundred percent tonight, and that's fine. Cause my baby hairs are not saying that. Like, I'm gonna put that out there. Let me put this, put that out there before y'all start trying to come to me. But at the end of the day, if you out with your dude or with your friends and your stuff is not looking right. Slipping. And. Right. Well, they okay. don't tell you, they then they really don't care right. about you anyway. Well, you Listen, if I'm ever with you anywhere at any point and the wig ain't wigging and the edges is not laid for the moment, well, then I need to know. That's That's different. Different. That's That's different. Different. I need to know. That's because if we out in public, people looking at me, That's I mean, you more so of a public check. figure than That's I am at this point. Come on. But what I'm saying is, what I'm saying is, whether your motherfucking baby hair is oompa loompa swirling in the It's the douce. Or not. Cause you gonna be like, oh girl, I like how your swirl goes to your hair. Your swirls are swirling. Well, I like the sparkle on swirl. your toenails, <laughs> girl. It's cute. I'm not negating it. Once mm-hmm. again, what I'm saying is, don't you don't worry. give a fuck. So if your fucking know, forehead come back to here, you don't talk and about you it, can't you? even manage a baby You're here, we don't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. We don't. Y'all heard it. Wave Jones on them. I'm just saying, <laughs> it's just something when men don't give a fuck about like well is know. there any hair if I've been right we like, like to keep up on appearance yeah. and that's just like, like I like human nature to go to the bar which I don't give a fuck that's what I want to know now Cause we, I'm just saying that was a small point oh, we, don't get, we, don't take care of we don't have an yeah, hour yeah personally that, that, that was that like the top three that I don't care about we don't care like we really don't care I don't care, don't care about like all the like jewelry and stuff yeah, like I, know. Know. I think that's like a personal yeah. thing like yeah, when yeah. I see a guy that just got a whole bunch of jewelry on for no reason it's just like I'm not serious. You know, I, if you doing a video shoot, if we doing a video shoot, we doing a video shoot, okay. But you know what I'm saying? We just, I like, yeah. you know, I don't care about that. You know what I'm saying? You clean, you smell good, you dressed well, okay, that's fine. But, you know, you don't have to look like you're going to shoot a video right. every single time. But well, before I get outnumbered, because I am outnumbered, bro, <laughs> no, you know, no, you know, those three is like the, like the least three that we don't give a You know how some guys need to wear fake jewelry and stuff. I don't know. Just to present. If it looks good, you know what I'm saying? Right. It's not going to turn me from not fucking you tonight. Or the shoes. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to say, like, um, you know, like some guys feel like they have to have, like, expensive shoes or they feel like they have to have, like, jewelry. Like that. that is something that I necessarily care about. As long as I'm not gonna say all that, but I'm gonna say like I don't. They don't have to be like George. You don't have to be in designer clothes all the time. What if you need a dude on me. and he's short and he got like size seventeen shoes? <laughs> I would tell him to buy smaller shoes. <laughs> if you wear a size 17, what could you do? Should I get a size 17 back there if you know? <laughs> oh, so, ladies, what, what, he's short and he wears a size 17. How I'm, long I'm with him. You want to sit beside him? Because you already know what it means, so. It might not be. Wait, both <laughs> face lies. Wears a size 17. Bold face lies. If I see that little short dude really, coming I toward me with the long feet. Okay, we're going to paint the image. He's five, <laughs> six. <laughs> I'm five, six. No. We, that's, that's what I'm giving him more high point. Five, five six, six. And he got a size 17 shoe. What kind of shoe is it? These. All right. Oh, well, to me. That's a vibrant this color. Is <laughs> that's it. That's I'm talking about character. Look. So however he approaches, however he approaches. So he's standing this high to you, next to you at this middle. Wow. Look. If he's look. spitting game, then. Look. Do y'all see this? <laughs> we at the movie theater. You like see me? And so the height is fine, but the size is that you feel. So you're going to date him? It depends on how he is. Yeah. I give him he chance. might be a nice guy. Yeah. I <laughs> gave some guys who I wasn't necessarily attracted y'all to. Y'all being fake. It fit my Bunk standard fake. of guy. And it worked. Because y'all don't fuck some big shoe fuckers and it wasn't <laughs> a big shoe fucker. I right. never know. He, he wasn't, said I'm not a big shoe fucker. He wasn't a big shoe fucker. <laughs> right. He had big what? shoes, but he wasn't a big shoe fucker. <laughs> mm, I bleed. <laughs> I'm just saying. I cannot be part of this. Left. May 26th. Left. <laughs> the varsity. Left. 
Look, this is not a children's show. No. This is exactly why I listen to everybody. Damn. Please get over to my YouTube page, Ellie Jackson 25, and subscribe. And then I'll be able to go live on there. So, the last question of the night, we have gone over just a little bit, but it's been real. Like, I enjoy it. <laughs> Y'all ass is, is out of control up here. they out of control. So, anything else? All I'm saying is, I mean, I can, I can leave us with the Jerry part of word. Rest in peace to Jerry. You know what I'm saying? That, that might be the, 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 the slogan for the uh, story. <laughs> what? Smoke one more way. Then we ain't got no weed either rolled up. I need some weed. It took y'all 30 minutes to roll up. I'll tell you a quick story time. All right, quick story time, quick smoke break. Where am I bag at? Did I bring my bag? I'll take another one. Which one is a good one? Okay, one more. One more. So one day, we was leaving from the gym. Where is my bag? We were leaving from the gym. What gym? Crunch. Okay. And we was already pumped up. Okay. Crunch. And we coming down, I think it was Bailey, North Bailey or something. We uh, it, it happened to run into a little bit of road rage. We can't be strong. They and it, man, they ain't paying us. Yeah, fuck that. But we came across yes, a little bit of road rage. Okay. And, um, That's good. It had to be. <laughs> uh, it, 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 Here, it, wait, wait, wait. It, it, no, was a, it was a white right. boy and his girlfriend in a car. In the parking lot? No, driving. Where are your glasses And they, they, like, and he just, he got real dickheadish, real, like, real quick, like, I don't know, his top got higher paws. Like, oh, no. <laughs> God, I gotta leave. What? No, <laughs> you were better off no, that's not the No, I'm saying, I'm trying to, I'm trying to place this example, because that's oh, how dickheadish she got. Oh, you had a hard paws. You understand me? He got like, he got like, um, like Super Mario Mushroom. Like, oh my God! Okay, you are like, dragging it. Silo, silo, last shot of the head. <laughs> so, look, yeah. so what I'm saying is, he got out of his gourd. Um, he uh -uh. pulled up to the side. I think he called us niggas with the ER. The hard. Ah, no, no, he didn't. I would have beat his ass. Yeah, we pursued it to do that. Yeah, so anyway, we get to a light. We kind of, I kind of cut him off because I was driving. So we get to a light. We both hop out. And he see, bro. And he said, oh, shit. I will probably, I'm talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't Specifically. want to. Uh -huh. no. uh -huh. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> it wasn't directed. No. You, the driver. <laughs> no. <laughs> he, he was nervous. No smoke. <laughs> Out the way. Right. The no, driver. you. So I said, I'm <laughs> not calm like this is not calm. So I said, cool. I'm going to beat you bad. and your bitch up. I don't hear women. But <laughs> she was... Copping a plea, and yes. her plea was saying, punch me, to me. Because he disrespected me, so, mm -hmm. and he felt like he didn't want to smoke with bro, so because we, 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 it, it came as a deal. It, it was a deal package. The conversation like, has so, um, to elongate the story, I chased him for a little while down Main Street, um, a couple of lights. And then we let him go. After she was pleading through the window, please stop. Why y'all driving? Yeah. Because yeah. <laughs> after I said, I'm going to beat you and your bitch up. So I know. Uh, he got back. He, he, he basically gave up. No. What? No school we got there. No. And he started. You want to do this too? He got the he got the boogie woogie and I chased him for a couple of blocks. I did. He's but like I said, when you seen bro, like bro already, you know what I mean, he got paused. That. You know what I mean? But no, we was like lifting weights and shit. So I was a little Slowly. bit with, and he was yeah, 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 yeah,
I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to him. <laughs> not you. Mm-hmm. Just to make sure that he got it right. Yeah, so. Just to clear my right. away. Let's, story yeah. time away. Story time away. We let them go. In One of we many to come. come. That was a very that was entertaining. Funny. I was doing that. I was pissed off because he tried to play me out like I'm gonna fight the skinny nigga. I'm gonna beat your ass. I'm gonna beat your bitch too. I was king of Yo, that's tough. Just cause. Just cause. Oh my god. I'm going to jail regardless. Might as well. Yeah, I'm going to jail. 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 i am going to jail 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 well, everybody, we're about to end it. 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 we are Thank y'all for coming out, for real. The round Thank you for podcast. coming and hanging out. Yeah, no, 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 no. Do it. Do, no, do it up, though, because you deserve all all the graces. You know what I mean? You doing yeah. it up. No, you definitely I mean, doing it. It ain't nothing big. It's just something it. that I feel like. You doing it. Y'all stop. Y'all stop. Y'all making the black girl blush. But, no, definitely. I appreciate the love, guys. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, I was nervous about it at first. Way definitely, you know, kind of gave me the push to go ahead and, and jump in and get it started. It's something I've been thinking about for a while. Mm-hmm. You know, I have, you know, talked to Ray about it or whatever. It's just all in, you know, putting that first foot forward. And that's the only thing you want to do, guys, you know. Practice, you never practice. know how it's going to go. Sometimes right. you just got to start. Sometimes you just got to get it going. So that's what we doing. We up and we running. Woo-hoo. We getting it going. Y'all tune in every Sunday night. Um, originally I wanted to record at 8 p.m. We started tonight at 10. So anywhere between 8 and 10 p.m. will be our time. But, you know, I definitely keep you guys posted on that. Again, subscribe to my YouTube page, Ellie Jackson 25 Definitely, I'm still working on that. But subscribe, get the subscribers up, and then I'll be able to live stream on there. But again, to all the viewers out there, whoever is viewing, I appreciate you guys again. Appreciate the love. So the last question of the evening that I like to ask, and I ask everybody, it was kind of corny, but this is my thing, and this is what I like to do, basically, so y'all with it? Mm -hmm. with it? Alright, so the question is, if you could be any superhero, which one would you be and why? Batman. Why would you be Batman? His car really fly. He be in like his little layer chilling, like just right. Like, Batman like, is dope. He real fly. And he like, got money too. For yeah. real, yeah. like he like he like got that long old paper bag money. <laughs> right, <laughs> <Batman. laughs> <laughs> He really do. He got an old bag. He got an old bag. He got that old bag. I would have to be for sure, for sure. All right, Tweety. Um, I'm new school. I probably be beast boy because he can change to any animal. I probably. Fly on the wall a couple of times. Listen, a fly on the wall. That's a good one. Fly on the wall. Because they are superheroes. The they can hear. Like the real one. No, no, no. That wave. If you could be any superhero, what would you be? You know me. I'm gonna be the same OG. I'm a thinker. I'm not as smart as, as Bruce Banner, but goddamn, I think I am. That's but right. you don't want to poke me and turn me green. You want to be on my good side because when I get green, I get mad. So you won't me. like me when I'm mad. You won't okay. like me when I'm mad. <laughs> So, you yeah, look like that when you go green? You look like that when you go green? How did I get here? What the fuck you look like that when you go green? Huh? You look like, look, on your shirt. Oh, no. Nah, I'm way bigger. <laughs> <laughs> I'm way bigger. He just Stop fighting. I don't know why they're doing that.
Superhero, and I always say that I would be the Phoenix. Mm -hmm. I explain why I would be the Phoenix because you know I just feel like I'm indestructible. I feel like I can stand through the fire and come out brand new. You know, I don't know my own power. I feel like you know I had to sacrifice a lot, and I always came back better. But I ain't gonna hold. And you. I'm still getting better. I, mean, <laughs> I ain't gonna hold you though. I think, I think next episode. I'm gonna be something different. Okay? Uh, you know what? I ain't never I mean, gonna be nobody hey, different. You know what? I'm screwed up. You gonna be him? You gonna be him? You gonna play him? I am gonna be him. I'm gonna be my nigga Marvin. I'm gonna be like, excuse me. I'm gonna be like, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Did you see a, a I can, rabbit? I can see that. really brown too on the other side. Super rabbit. Yeah, yeah. Super I have my space modulator. Your brother. <laughs> They've been yeah, having that. Yeah. We we have listen. This show was Ooh, dope. Wee. Like, thank everybody for coming out. Thank you for having us. Way family over here. I'm, my, I'm, my, I'm, my, I my, can try, I'm trying not to my, call you Trey because you. Can, <laughs> that's what he been <laughs> saying before I met you. He keeps saying my, that. But it? my, he called it Trey. My, right. Brown Superman toys. <laughs> but definitely, we getting ready to jump off, guys. Definitely get to my YouTube and subscribe. Ellie Jackson twenty five. We in the game. No, I spell it out. The in the back. Going back. E L L Y Jackson. Two five. Right, you talk too get in there. Subscribe, y'all. Definitely go and check out the Roundtable Podcast. D A. Get it right. D A. <laughs> Not the 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 definitely go and check it out, y'all. Have a way, y'all. Definitely go and check out Ray's page, Ray Jean Denise. Mm -hmm. Y'all definitely go and holler at Tweety. Makeup if you want your face beat and many other things. This lady wears many hats. <laughs> Mar, next time went. he come on, we gonna find out what he got going on and then what he gonna y'all over there that way. Hold on, if y'all wanna, wanna holler at Mar, go in on Instagram, type in Brother Malcolm Jamal Warner. <laughs> <laughs> no, no lower cases. No all caps. <laughs> Brother <laughs> Malcolm Jamal Warner, no. all lower cases. <laughs> 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 
But that's what's up, y'all. Definitely. Thank y'all for tuning in to the Den. (laughs) We will see y'all next Sunday. We're going to have more great content, more great artists. Just a lot of good shit. We're going up from here. Thank y'all for tuning in. Ellie. Have a good night. Ellie. Good night. Yeah, Lion's Den. Uh, Lioness Den. <laughs> the Den. Because the the there's some lionesses in here. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>